when people acknowledge it, you know, and I'm, I'm, I'm sure you're doing it regardless. You know, you, you, you simply love it and you see that it's helping you and making you more confident. Mm-hmm. But to have people noticing that, you know, it must, it pushes you. It must, you know, give you extra, <clears throat> extra drive to do it, to become even better and stronger, right? So now that we spoke about the gym mm-hmm. and we're going to show a video, we're going to show a video to show all of you guys. How much this 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 guy is not playing around? Fabian is not playing games. So, like he comes in, he takes this shit seriously. No, yeah, cause like so. like I uh I like when I go to when I listen to when I go to the gym, I just listen to like one of these musics. Like one of these old school hip hop music, and they motivate me like. They they push me hard, mm-hmm. so I listen to like old school hip hop, and they put me motivation. And if I listen to house music, it like gets you going. Yeah, yeah, it must get yeah fires you up. Yeah, cause like I feel like I feel the beat, and the beat goes to the heart, and and it pumps up the blood. Sure. Yeah, the, the music. I mean, the difference between music and no music in the gym, different world. It's, it's very difficult to, mm. to really get that that pump, that serious mental strength mm-hmm. without it. I'm sure. I mean, listen, I've forgotten my headphones a couple of times. You have the <laughs> you have the music in the gym, which does not pump you up. It's very nope. Neat, right? It's pop usually. Nope, not really. Yeah, definitely not. So, what what happened? <clears throat> Excuse me. What is the condition? Explain it to us. Well, How does it work? How does it work? It's a funny question. No, we'll it's cool. It, it. It, it's cool. Um, when I was a kid, when I was a little kid, I, they, um, I don't know what to say, but the doctors told my parents saying that uh, he's, he's uh, suffering from the right brain because for the for my right brain it slows down the water and they drill they drill uh like a gun like one of those doctors that use those tools to drill the head or something like that i don't know Mm -hmm. but they drill the head and they put like a shunt in my in in my body in my stomach because i had a first mark when i was a baby they put it in there and then they when i got up i felt fine but when i get headaches and headaches and and more headaches migraines it starts to kick in so i had a migraine i had a i had to throw up i had a Like, I couldn't open my eyes, so I had to do all that kind of stuff. And then my they took me to the helicopter. So I went on the helicopter to go to... There's this hospital called Miami Children. So now they changed the name to uh, some other name in Children's Hospital. So they took me there, and they, start, they fixed me up. I felt fine. And then... What did they do? How did they fix you up? They had they had they had to get one of those uh, shunt things, whatever it's called. What, what is a shunt, by the way? Because there there are medical professionals will know. Um, about. what is that? A tube of some sort. Yeah, it's like a tube. It's like a tube that they put inside a, a, a on your head to go all the way down to your stomach. It goes like right here. Well, there's all different types. So there there's all different types. Like they put it back in your. Uh, if you have a condition, spine condition in your back, they put a shunt there or in your head, they put it back here. Mm-hmm. So I had that. So they just put it in, in the back of my head all the way to my stomach so I can go so the water can work. So I can go to the bathroom properly or drink and that's it. Excuse me. Without that, you wouldn't be able to. you telling me. Nope. I couldn't do anything, so they fixed me up. I felt fine. Then I couldn't walk, so I had to like uh, practice my walk, like practice walking. So I had like two, like two casts in my leg, both of them. 
So I had I went to I was in an elementary school. So they gave me a wheelchair. So I had to like one of the students put push me to a different class, and if they took the cast off, and it was okay with me. How long did it take until you were able to actually walk, like walk on your feet? Uh, I don't remember. I don't remember. A couple of months, over a year. Oh yeah, I think it was over a year, but I'm not sure. I don't remember when it happened. But I just remember I had like a cast on both legs. Wow. Yeah, but it was cool. And you see that for there, there are people watching this, me included. I've never had that. Right. Mm -hmm. I've been able to. I've been blessed to be able to to walk on my feet like with no issue no because like if you're playing if you're playing sports if you're if your leg is broken then you just like use like figure out just use the because there's like a whole bunch of athletes that that use a wheelchair and they then they work out Mm -hmm. And, and they don't care they just do like keep moving I've seen that. It's unbelievable. You'll mm-hmm. see a guy in a wheelchair. He's doing chin-ups, pull-ups. Mm-hmm. Absolutely jacked mm-hmm. from the waist up. And there's one one Incredible. of those one of uh, those bodybuilders that are in the wheelchair and they're competing. They don't care. Exactly. Exactly. At the end of the day, I mean, I I I have never experienced that. I haven't gone through that. But I mean, the fact that they're doing that, the fact that they're so motivated. When they have that setback, you know, they have that difficulty. There's nothing they can do about it. Mm-hmm. But they're, they're going in every single day and they're killing it. Just like you, man, you know? Yeah. You don't let these things stop you. I mean, like, you I know? just, I just like, I feel bored. I just, like, sit down and watch my smart TV and watch, like, bodybuilding. And, like, Jake Cutler, he expires me. Uh, Kyle Green, same thing. He expires me. Uh... Michael Hearn, he expires me. So they both do. Mm-hmm. And I'm um, like on it every day. <laughs>